Hi guys. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm late again. I mean, what can I say at this point? Should we even need to talk about it? Do I even need to say I'm sorry? This is just the way it is. <laughs> well, let me tell you why I'm like two minutes later than normal. Randy brought home this gorgeous bottle of rosé and I filled this huge glass of rosé, one for each of us, and I was, you know, I don't know what I was doing in the kitchen, but I reached over and I just knocked it over. Just knocked over the whole glass, the glass shattered, the rosé is everywhere, they we're cleaning up glass. <laughs> it's, it's a good way to start things, you know what I mean? Like, let's just really, let's just start things in shambles. Um, but this, this is the wine we're drinking. It's all in French, so you know it's good. This is Le Vigneron Coteron. It's a Coteron, it's Grenache, Syrah, and Seen Salt. I mean, listen, it can't, it can't be that bad. <laughs> yes, I do have ice cubes in my wine. I am that person right now because I stand here for over an hour and my drink gets warm. No one wants a warm rosé. Okay. Oh, that's good. RIP giant glass of rosé. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Here we are. So how are you guys doing? <laughs> Let me just adjust. Let me just adjust. Okay. Guys, it's Wednesday happy hour. How are you doing? How's it going? Um, and what's funny is I felt really, really like leisurely and prepared for this. I was like, you know, I really feel like I'm might be on time today. I, I feel like I'm not hurried and then just, pff, it's fine. It's fine. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Guys, guys, the good job gang is all here. Um, I mean, I don't feel they're all here, but there's quite a few of them here. And I see someone brand new, uh, Colette Osuna is here. Well, that's a fabulous name. Speaking of French, that sounds, Colette sounds French to me. Um, and she's saying she's like, this is her first time here at Alive. So welcome to her. Um, scrolling, just scrolling to see what I missed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So much love, so much love in the room. Seeing all the love. Carolyn is here, Elizabeth Oster, Jerry Morrison, Kim McConnell, Lauren Boylis. What more do you want? I have my my very quiet AC on, um, which I, I won't stop talking about. I refuse to stop talking about it <laughs> because it's that life changing. Randy is in the kitchen. He has like this huge fan directly on him. It's, it's like, it's like our lives have been elevated in this crazy way. And it's called air condition, <laughs> quiet air conditioning. Oh my gosh. It's so high ho the glamorous life over here in New York. Um, <laughs> Arturo Luna is here. Yes. Anieska Piazkowitsk is here. I just like saying her name, really. Okay. Okay. Well, there's a lot to catch up on. I'm, I'm mesmerized by all the, oh, Tara Breeden just became a good job gang member. Well, welcome. Welcome. Oh, Roy Croft girl. Hi everyone. This is only my second time watching this live. I've watched all of her other videos. Well, hello. Welcome. I love it when people can join live because while I always appreciate people watching it on replay, um, there's nothing like being here live. People who don't come don't know what they're missing. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's right. I do have Tito's in my, see, this is what happens when I have to change my description box now. Hold, please. Also, I need the focus being more on the lips and less on that. <laughs> so let me just adjust. Okay. 
that's such a joy and a pleasure about going live too. Like you can't fully see what the shot is going to look like until you go live. That's a terrible way to do that, YouTube. It's just, it's just a terrible way to be. Well, you know, if I ran YouTube, <laughs> but I don't. Okay, I was going to correct what was in the description box. See, I appreciate the, all you guys who are checking the description box. Here we go. French rosé. Yes, there we have it. There we have it corrected for all to see. I feel better now, don't you? Let me go back to the chat. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Well, I think <laughs> I think we're all set up now. Um, first of all, welcome. Welcome to everyone. Welcome to everyone who's here all the time. Welcome to everyone who's brand new. Oh, Better Off Red is here. I just saw. Mayhaps. Or I saw her name pop up. Pop up, pop up. Oh, Sarah Kleinsmith is here. Sarah Chizzo. Yeah, Sarah Chizzo made it for a live. Okay. Okay. So do my little spiel. If you guys please would be so kind. There's 159 people watching, which is absolutely incredible. If, if those people could so kindly, you like how I always add so kindly, like what does it matter it, the manner in which you do this? Just click the thumbs up. You can do it angrily. You can be pissed at me while you do it. You could even be so mad that you give me a thumbs down and you know what? It's all the same on YouTube because that's just the kind of world we live in. Any attention is good attention. <laughs> YouTube teaching, teaching us terrible lessons. <sighs> okay, Renee Leonard is here. I think she was like the first to comment today. Guys, I can't stop wearing puffy sleeve shirts. And the video that's coming out tomorrow is another puffy sleeve shirt. I don't want to tell you. I just went crazy buying puffy sleeve shirts and I won't, I, I will not be stopped. Um, okay, so if you could give this a thumbs up, that'd be awesome. If you haven't subscribed, I mean, my God, what are you doing with your life and your choices? Subscribe, damn it. I said subscribe. Okay. Then after you've done those things, you have options. I like to give you guys options. You can always be a part of the good job gang. You don't have to do any of these options, but it's super fun. You get this little head wrap lady next to your name. Your name is lit up in green. Um, there are other perks to it. I do give exclusive merch discounts, which we're gonna get to in a hot second because there's new merch. New merch alert. Um, other perks I'm working on and I'm in the process of getting going are exclusive blooper reels from my videos. I'm going to get, get my shit together and start doing that. Also, Randy thought it might be a good idea to offer the dramatic readings of shitty comments as an exclusive perk to Good Job Gang members. And I think I'm going to take that and run with it. So those are some, you know, good parts of being a part of the Good Job Gang. Okay, so there's that. You can also send a super chat, right? If you don't know what a super chat is, it's that dollar sign at the bottom. It's pretty self-explanatory. You donate money to the channel and your comment lights up and you can send dancing fruit and stickers and everything your heart ever wanted. Um, you can also donate what you would have sent through a super chat to my Venmo PayPal. That means that YouTube doesn't get 30% of the cut. You can also, and Randy's gonna put that, that Venmo PayPal in the, the chat. It's always linked in my description box. That's the other thing I wanna say everything's in the description box. So if you're wondering what shade I'm using or what the hell I'm drinking or what I'm wearing, or I do my best to put everything down there before I begin. And I'm going to tell you right now, it takes a while. So you're welcome. <laughs> you're welcome. Okay. I do it for you. I do it for you. Maybe I should just try to do this whole live stream. Like everything is just sort of like I'm a martyr, like just making you feel 
like everything. I'm here for you. That's why I'm here. <laughs> I was gonna say something and I was gonna relate it to Tati, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna hold that in my head. <laughs> I kind of already said it, but back it up, 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 back it up. Okay. So also hit that notification bell. I always forget to say that. I've started putting in my videos because I don't always put my videos out on the same day, same time. It changes and it really helps because otherwise you don't know when my videos come out and what good does that do anyone okay martyrdom queen yes yes okay we'll probably get to it the whole I don't want to like launch into all that drama right now like right off the bat but that's what I'm that's all I'm giving you right now just those that's how I feel about the drama that's for better off red. She loves when I do that. Okay. I took my allergy pills and yet it's still not helping. <laughs> okay. So the really exciting news of the day is that yes, indeed, I put out brand new merch. I put out sweaty swatching merch. I enlisted the help of the amazing Sarah of better off red. I, we collaborated. I told her I wanted sweaty swatching merch. We had some ideas. She put it into play. It looks so cute. So cute. The word sweaty is literally sweating onto the word swatching. I mean, that's just, it's brilliant is what it is. So anyway, we've got the sweaty, Sarah's already texted me a picture of me with my eyes. Okay. Thank you, Sarah. I'm, it's like, I almost don't feel complete unless she texts me a picture of me looking hideous in my live stream. Um, sweaty swatching merch, but maybe even a little bit more exciting because this has been something that you guys have been asking for, for, well, since the beginning of COVID-19. Um, masks. Teespring, I, I, I wish I could, I wish I could remember. I believe her name is Mel is the name of the subscriber who on Instagram today told me, oh, Sherry Ford, $50 dramatic reading, please. Oh, <laughs> Sherry Ford's declaring she's, she's demanding a dramatic reading. Hold please. <laughs> dramatic reading, please. I do declare your New York so kindly sounds suspiciously like our Southern, well, bless your heart. Can't, can't wait uh, to get the masks ordered today. Oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, Sherry. That's hilarious. Thank you for the Venmo. <laughs> when it would not be like a live stream until, you know, it's not a live stream until Sherry Ford pays me, essentially is what I'm trying to say. Just kidding. Kind of. Okay, so we've got the sweaty swatching. We've also got the masks with their back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up masks. Teespring finally came out with cloth masks. They're, they, they look fantastic, honestly. They have the, the ear loops. Yes, I was crediting a subscriber for saying to me today, Kate, they finally, Teespring is offering cloth masks. I ran to Teespring to make these masks. <laughs> I did. I really did. Um, and I mean, I already have one in the mail coming to me. I sent one to Michelle. I sent one to Sarah. I, I'm way too excited about the masks. I'm just glad because I wrote Teespring quite some time ago saying, can you please offer masks? And they're like, yes, we're getting... We're getting a lot of requests for that, but they didn't, that's all he said. And I was like, well, that's not going to happen, <laughs> but, but they got them. So anyway, um, I've linked, I believe most of my merch pops up underneath my videos anyway, but I've linked the Teespring store where you can purchase sweaty swatching, where you can purchase back it up, 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 back it up masks. It's in the description box. So just click on that. What are people saying? What are people saying? Samantha Prentice, Venmo $5, just a little gift. Thank you, Samantha Prentice, that's so sweet. Thank you, that's a lovely little gift. Um, 
Okay, let me scroll and see what y'all are saying. Yes, if you guys don't know, Sarah of... Oh gosh, so annoying that I have to say Sarah better off red. Should I say Sarah? Should I say better off red? Because if I say Sarah, then I guarantee you other people are going to be like, who's Sarah? Anyway, Better Off Red is very, very talented. She, I don't know if you know this about her. I hope I'm not exposing anything she doesn't want me to expose, but she's very artistic. And she, I believe she was an art major in college. Is that correct, Sarah? You know, I miss speaking. She's very, very talented. Um, so anyway, annoying, annoyingly talented. Oh, Sally Goach, I got my youngish shirt yesterday and it's butter soft. Ooh, guys, I, I picked the good shirts. I'm not, we're not doing like the crappy shirts. We're doing a premium shirt, a premium hoodie. We didn't have options with the masks, but I'm sure they're fine. Okay. And if you wanna see like in the thumbnail that I made today, I included a picture of the mask and the sweaty swatching. Oh, Venmo, Angelia Ogden, and An An Angelia probably, Ogden, thank you for your service times too. That's so sweet. Thank you for the $10 Venmo. Well, this makes up for the rose that I just completely ruined. Mm -hmm. Linda, live your life. I want to see you model the merch, Kate. Well, when I get it, you best believe I'm going to be on the gram showing you what it looks like. I, I got the sweaty swatching tank. It's a flowy tank. And then I got the mask. Okay, so another thing. This is, this is the time when I like assign you things to do. That's what happens. I basically just ask things of you. <laughs> And a lot of you do them. So you're just reinforcing the behavior. You see, do you see what you're doing here? Um, if you could share the link to those masks, I wouldn't be mad about it. Because I'm telling you right now, even if you don't give a shit about who I am or Kate the Great Beauty, it has my little insignia up at the top that Sarah created. Where would I be without Sarah? Um, even if you don't know who I am, Back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. I mean, I have to say, it did not start out as a story, anything to do with face masks, but damn if it didn't work out. Maybe one of the only things that worked out in this time. But share on the Facebook, you know what I mean? Share on the gram, share the love. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, scrolling up. Oh, Arshel Duncan, I can't wait for a larger size of the purple, purple neck shirt. Well, all of the, I don't know about the purple, maybe certain colors are run, running out of stock or something, but everything comes in a variety of colors and this, a lot of sizes, a lot of sizes, just so you know. Karen K, send a back it up mask to Governor Cuomo. Maybe I will. <laughs> okay. Yes, Kathy said she shared. Yes, Kathy, thank you. Michelle Eaton, hi, Kate. I've been super busy and have missed a bunch of your lives. Glad to finally be here again. Welcome back, Michelle. Oh, good, okay, okay. Lauren's requesting good job gang merch. Okay, noted, noted. Got it. Lynn Piccolo just ordered my back it up mask. You guys know, I mean, I'm not gonna tell the story right now. I think it's still on my Instagram, but the actual back it up story is basically from my time when I was doing a Norwegian cruise line contract and we had to travel to Singapore to get on the ship. And just go, just, just go watch the story. <laughs> we don't have time to tell that story again, but that's where it all began. Um, Oh, Angela Strange. Hi, new subscriber. Excited to watch. Thank you for subscribing. I also want to thank everyone. I want to thank Michelle Wong 
and everyone who came over from her channel since her Patrick Ta video because she was kind enough to mention my channel and I think it gained me like definitely over 100 subscribers. So thank you to everyone who's brand new here. I really appreciate you. Oh, Heidi Ho Paints. Yes, she sent me over. Well, thank you, Heidi Ho Paints. Jamie Mayfield, what are we talking about today? The state of the nation, the failing economy, the fact that I hate DeSantis like it is my job. Look, Jamie really, when she comes to the live streams, she comes to play. She's not messing around. You know what I mean? She's not getting down to business. Um, yeah, everyone quit wearing masks is, is what Lori is saying. Yeah, let's, let's not quit wearing them. Let's wear them more. Because that didn't help, the quitting of the wearing of the masks. Okay. So, today I am doing an Ulta haul. I bought a bunch of stuff from Ulta. I'm really excited to try a lot of it. Star of the show, super on pins and needs to find out what I think of the ColourPop Pretty Fresh, this is brand new, the Pretty Fresh Hydrating Foundation. Um, so this is like a medium coverage foundation. The Pretty Fresh that they initially released was a tinted moisturizer, um, which I love. So I'm excited to try this. Anyway, this is an Ulta haul. Um, let's get started, right? Okay. Oh, I didn't list my earrings. Linda's saying, you know what? I don't think these are available anymore, but I will check. They're Kendra Scott. That's the, if I don't list things I'm wearing, it's generally because womp womp, they're discontinued or unavailable. Um, okay. So a lot of this is drugstore. Yeah, almost all of it is drugstore prices, except like a couple items. Um, some stuff that I just impulsively bought and I was like, well, let's give this a whirl. Okay. So this is actually a product. I didn't, this isn't brand new, but I just haven't used it in a long time. This is my Maybelline baby skin instant pore eraser. Tara Ball, any plans for the fourth? Like we can do anything. Yeah, no, not really. No. We're going to watch Independence Day. Yes, abs we're going to play a drinking game, the Independence Day, which is one of the most fun things you can do. And maybe Randy created a drinking game for it, and it's pretty great. I'll post it on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, do it. Because I post fun things like that, and we're all having a damn good time. Oh, Hamilton. Yes, Hamilton's on Friday on Disney Plus. Definitely going to watch that because that's the original cast. And I I never saw Hamilton. I feel like I've seen Hamilton because I know the soundtrack really well. And I've seen a lot of like live clips of it. Not the same, obviously. But I'm really excited to see the full, the full production. Have Ms. Robbie Lou, have the fireworks calmed down for you guys? Um, yeah, they have. It was really bad for a while. Now it's uh, it's just sort of intermittent. Um, yes, Kim McConnell. Oh, you'll love Hamilton. Oh, I know. I know. And I like I've had several friends who have been in the I had a friend who was in the Chicago cast and which makes me even more embarrassed that I've never <laughs> never seen Hamilton. Um, guys, it was expensive to see Hamilton. It was expensive. <laughs> mm. Anna Cobble. I'm sorry, Anna. I always butcher, butcher your last name. Is it like, is it Cable? Cobble? I don't know. I've seen Hamilton three times. Well, excuse me. Okay, money bags. <laughs> okay, bougie pants. Mmm. <laughs> Okay. Art by Casey. Do you know if kids are going back to school in New York? No, not, t I don't know, but definitely not this year. What, what do you, no, right? I don't know. No, no one's going back to anything. 
because we were, you know, looking at basically like restaurants, indoor, like being able to sit inside like you normally do in a restaurant, but that's sort of off the table now. So, which I think is a good call. I think it's a good call. Oh, Kirsten Hines, I teach in New York, so no definite plans yet waiting on the governor. Right, okay. It's Cabell, like cab. Oh, Cabell, that makes sense. Okay, Anna Cabell, got it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna, we're gonna do it. We're, we're un, it's an unboxing. So I got the ColourPop Pretty Fresh foundation in the shade light 55 n i mean i just who knows who knows and apparently like i said this is a medium coverage foundation it does have hyaluronic acid in it it's buildable it's a natural finish okay so we'll see we'll see what we think here little pump little pumpy pump oh i think that might actually be a good shape for me okay Bonnie, Kate, what's the promo code? Bonnie, what are you talking about? Okay. Um, Kate, what? Iana, Iana Carvalho. Kate, what size of the youngish hoodie do you wear? I'm tall. You know what? I, I have a couple different... Well, I have like three of my hoodies, two or three of my hoodies. Um, one, I got a little bit more fitted, which was a large, which isn't fitted at all. But I like things really, really big and cozy, like sweats and things like that. So I actually got an extra large in the youngish. It looks cute either way, but they're, they're, it's unisex sizing. So it's basically men's, the hoodies are men's sizing. Now... A lot of the t-shirts are like the v-necks are for women I mixed it up you know what I mean I like to mix it up mm, 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 mm. oh Bonnie I see I'm sorry I understand I understand what you meant well someone else got it covered <laughs> yeah so I need to be paying attention to what I'm doing how about that how about that? Let me get a mirror out. So this is really nice. I mean, I don't, you know, I don't like a heavy coverage. So this is probably as heavy as I like to go generally. Because then if it's like, if you get a medium foundation and it's buildable, I mean, you can make it full coverage if you want. Pamela Willis, I don't think that the merch runs small. It's pretty true to size. Yes, it is. It is true to size for sure. It doesn't run small. That's that's for sure. Does it feel heavy on the face or clammy? It does not feel heavy on the face. But I'm impressed at how like quickly it's giving me some really nice natural coverage. I mean, obviously I'll have to see how it wears. I can't speak to that right now, but so far so good. I'm liking it. So this is only available at Ulta right now, I think. I don't think it's available available on ColourPop at the moment. Again, everything is linked down below. It runs for $16. Liz Chambers, hi, welcome. Does it have a scent? I never pay attention to that because scents don't really bother me, but it does not have a scent. No, it does not. So, Did I put on the primer? I did, I did put on the primer. I used my, the Baby Soft Pore Eraser Primer, which is good. 
I mean, I like it. It's, it's a gel, a gel primer and it definitely just goes on like silk and it's cheap. It's cheap for you cheap asses out there. Um, okay. So I think we're good with the foundation and yeah, it's a good color match actually pretty impressed, pretty impressed with myself. <laughs> I'm super impressed with myself. Um, guys, I fell down a kind of a, I don't want to say a rabbit hole, but I definitely wanted to like understand everything that's happening with now I'm going in with the ColourPop Pretty Fresh concealer, which is one of my faves. Definitely found it fell down kind of a rabbit hole about this, all this drama, because I'm a person who like, I don't know what's going on in terms of drama to a point of it's almost embarrassing. Like, like, how can I even say I'm a part of the beauty community, I guess? <laughs> but, but I, I had to like watch the Tati video just to know, to understand. I mean, I didn't have to, but I did. I just pre preparing for this. I was listening to Smokey Glow's take on Tati's, uh, what did she call? Uh, breaking her silence, which is really dramatic. Um, I don't have like a lot to say about it. I mean, it's all just tragic trash. It's all just like, it's so messed up. Like, I don't even know. I don't know how to even broach the topic. Um, oh, Steph's Beauty Stash is here. Steph's Beauty Stash is adorable. She has a YouTube channel. Please check her out. She's another like cute, cutie patoots pixie. And she does amazing makeup looks. Um, yeah, Steph's Beauty Stash. I just found out about her recently. Um, no, it's all trash. And I, I have to say, I'm amazed at, at people like Smokey Glow who like, really get in there with the details and can articulate it in this really clear way because I am wildly confused. I'm like, what? I... The he, she said, she said this happened, the bi girl and the, they're out, they went to dinner and the birthday party. I'm just like, oh my God, <laughs> my head is about to blow off my body entirely. Um, but I will say I did watch Tati's 40 minute video It's really long. Not that I can really, you know, be hard on anyone about making long content because we're gonna be here for over an hour. Um, I don't know, I just, I guess I kind of feel like, it felt a little, like I, I mentioned m martyr, martyrdom early, and I felt like it was a little, like she kept on saying that she, you know, remain friends with Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson because, you know, she thought that she could basically better them as humans is basically what she would kept on saying. And I, I just couldn't help but feel like, well, how condescending can you be? I mean, just like, you know, like, I just noticed they were bad people. But like, I thought I'd just stick around because I just thought I could really just make them better. Kind of like Mother Teresa, just like, Give it a whirl, see how it went. What? You're gonna make monster, <laughs> these monsters into, come on. Come on. No. Which I think is like a good, you know, it's a good spin. It's a good thing to lean into because it kind of like makes her sound like, well, the reason I stayed with these, around these monsters was because like, I was just like giving them a second chance. Well, don't do that. My God, how did that work out for you? Terribly. Jeffree Star scares me to a point, like I, I'm, she kept on talking about like, we need to be ready to forgive people because Jeffree Star has all these receipts on like everyone. I thought, well, I'm so scared. Maybe he has receipts on me. <laughs> I don't know what they would be, but I bet you he could find some. I, I bet he could. I mean, he's just, 
his very like essence i i watched like a brief clip of him today and i was just like just he's just he looks like <laughs> it's not about how he looks but it's just his vibe it's just such a dark vibe you can see he's gonna come for anyone he can <laughs> Yes, Jeffree Star is like a Bond villain. Yes. And he's always got those like long, like clicky clacky claws, you know, and you can't really fault him for using them all the time. Because like when I had clicky clacky claws, because I did, I was like, just I was that gal like using her hands with the nails. But like, that's him. He's just always like this. <laughs> camera and I'm just like Jeffrey I know you love your nails but I'm gonna need you to like take it I'm gonna need you to back it up back it up back it up, back it up. stop overusing your fingies I don't want to see those in the cam have I mean I've never spoken about any of these people on my channel it's not like I really care but I thought you know since I did all the work I may as well share my thoughts. I did the work, you know what I mean? See, I, you can turn anything into, you, I can be a martyr. I just really like, I really wanted to delve in so I could like understand, so I could explain it to you guys. Like that's, cause I'm here for you, you know? <clears throat> okay. I did, I opened the can of worms, but like, listen, I gotta do something with this information. It's all in my head now. And now you have to listen to it. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, Jamie Mayfield is saying, I'm more upset with people being more upset with Tati than they ever get over Jeffree Star. Tati is whatever, but Jeffree Star just gets away with so much horrible shit like racism and violence. Oh, yeah, for, oh, for sure. There, this is not, this is not being disputed. I already, monster, monsters monster times with him and Shane Dawson. And like, you know, Tati just, she got caught up in it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jafar, that's a good call. Yes, yes, if Jeffree Star were a Disney villain, he would be Jafar. I love that. Okay. Okay, moving on, moving on. We did the Pretty Fresh. I'm going to use my Urban Decay um, eyeshadow primer potion, which I completely forgot about for like a year. You know when you find a good thing and you're like, this is amazing, and then you just don't do it? You're like, oh, I mean. And then you pick it back up again, and you're like, why did I stop that? that? That helped everything. Kind of like I started meditating again which like changed my life years ago. And I, I just felt so much calmer and lovely. And then I just stopped. I guess I was like, well, I'm good now. I mean, I feel good. So I guess I'll just stop whatever's making me feel good. And yes, I am comparing meditation to the Urban Decay eyeshadow primer potion. <laughs> They're one in the same, basically. I'm just kidding. Yes, I think there is a lot of sexism. I totally agree. Michelle uh, and I were talking about this. I don't think she would mind me saying that, like, I mean, I think it goes without saying that, like, obviously women just suffer the consequences more, you know? Um, and men kind of get away <laughs> with murder. Okay. Now what? Now what? Um, wow, there's just lots to be there's lots to be read. I'm just reading it all. Um, Samantha Robindahl made a great video about the Shane Toxic Guru. Yes, I love I do like Samantha Robindahl. Um, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, great. 
So ColourPop, ColourPop. Okay, this is the uh, no filter translucent setting powder. I mean, this has lasted me forever. I'm just ready to be done with it. I mean, I like it, but it's like, God, it's, that's not good when you're like mad at a product for lasting forever. I should be happy, but it's also like, I can't even get through this in like three years. This is tiny. Okay, so going in with this. But do you think any of these people are really, I mean, they're gonna, they've made bazillion dollars. They're gonna be just fine, which is sad, but. Sad but true. Sad but true. <laughs> Jess A. I hope that's how you say your name because I'm obsessed with it. That's like Jack Hay. Jess A. There are t there's a tone and not a good one when you're white and you're asking for prayers and you're a bajillionaire. Um, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, all right, we're powdered, we're good, we're good. I'm not even looking at what I'm doing. I'm just like looking at comments and going, I'm like, this is great. This guy's gonna look so good. Yes, that's how to say my name, girl. I love that you can say, just say. I'll say that all day long. It's the best name ever. Do I have the Tati palette? I do not, but I kind of wanted it. And when I was visiting Sarah, better off red, she had it and it was admittedly stunning. Okay. I don't have the pretty fresh spray, unfortunately. I can't, I don't, I don't have that. I should get it. Molly McKay, say what you will about her, but that Tati palette is the bomb. Mm -hmm. Karen, <clears throat> Karen K, sorry. There's a hilarious Trump makeup tutorial video on YouTube. The channel is Trump the Internet. Karen, funny you should bring that up. Because someone standing in this room also did a Trump makeup tutorial. <laughs> Mm. Okay, moving on. Moving on. Throwing out things as we go here. So a lot, yeah, a lot of these things are, well, a couple of these things are unboxings. Very, very exciting. So this is the, yeah, if you guys haven't seen that tutorial, guys, get on it. <laughs> Michelle said that's how she found me. Well, there you go. And that's how a bunch of people left me. Bye. Okay, so uh, Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer in the shade Bronzer, which is on sale right now at Ulta. I might, I might add. I did link that. I listed that in the description box. On sale, I think it's like $4 off or something like that. Okay. I forgot to link all my brushes today, guys. I'm sorry. I wasn't on top of it. But if you want to know what brushes I'm using, almost all of them are the same ones I use in my Monday live stream. You can just check the description box on that. Yeah, I guys, I'm really digging on this foundation. Is there that much orange fat? orange foundation in the world. I used um, just orange eyeshadow for that tutorial and it was very effective, I found. Very, very effective. Yes. Abigail, hi. What did I miss? Mm-hmm.
Okay. Oh, Randy said, yes, if you search presidential makeup tutorial, it should come up. That's correct. That's correct. Yeah, we're getting in there with the bronzer. It's going to be a glowy sitch. Oh, I don't want to get bronzer on this though. Hold on a second. Hold please. Let's just push that up. Okay. Yes, Bethany Forsyth. Just ordered my back it up mask. Can't think of a more perfect mask. Thank you. Thank you guys. Have I gotten the new Natasha Denona face palette? Lynn, I'm aware. Have you been? It's been in like my last three videos. Uh, yeah, it's been in my last three videos. Check it out. Val Lushy, Lushy. I hope it's Lushy. <laughs> do you have Do you have now any perspective for your artistic career? No, no. I don't, no. Oh no! I have all the perspective I need on my artistic <laughs> on on performance arts. <laughs> Please don't give me any more perspective. I'm perspectived out. I'm up here with perspective. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, it's a Chinese name. Oh, okay. Okay. That's not what I would have guessed, but I'm into it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Art by Casey. I think I drink more when I'm hanging out with you. I'm going to take that as a compliment. I drink more when I'm hanging out with me too. So I get it. I get it. <clears throat> Lynn, I haven't been feeling well and have unfortunately missed all the YouTube videos. Well, Lynn, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you're feeling better and no worries. I mean, it's not an emergency situation. <laughs> They'll always be there for you. Okay. Steph's beauty stash. I'm about to pour drink number three. Yes, Steph. Yes, yes. Pour the drink. Okay. Tati's a martyr. I'm an enabler. Okay. Are we clear? Well, I feel very bronzed. I feel very, very bronzed. Okay. Now, next we're moving on to Anieska, Kate, can you bronze the tan lines? Pretty please. Okay. I see. I see. Oh. Really demanding today, honey. Eskia piazza Let me just. I was gonna try to make this shorter today, but I guess, guess I'm not. So. It's gonna take a while. Okay. <laughs> Please stop. No. No. I will bronze my tan lines until you're sick of it. Okay. Well, I hope that helped. I was doing it like a, I was really detailed with that. I don't know if you could tell, but
Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Wow, there's lots of there's lots of thoughts. Trash trashly fellers. <laughs> Late to the party. What's your foundation and shade? Well, I'm highly distracted by your name. Um, but it's all in the description box. Everything, everything I have on my face can be found down below. Down below. Okay. Wow, well, we really bronzed up a storm here. Oh, maybe I did forget to, I just found my allergy pill. I thought I took it. I didn't. That'll be better. Oh my goodness, Kim McConnell just bought six masks. Thank you, Kim McConnell. Well, damn. Guys, listen. We have been talking about my sunburn for three straight weeks. <laughs> I'm doing my best. For God's sake. Okay. Next, we're going to, um, yes, masks. Uh, sorry if you guys missed it. I do. I am selling masks. I'm a mask seller for your convenience. I have brand new merch. You can check it out down below in the description box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, what if I just, this whole rest of the live stream is like, it's just the description box, just in there, just down there and down below, just down below this video. If you like, if you scroll just all the different ways to be like, it's down, it's down there. <laughs> okay. Next. Next. This is brand new. I bought it at Impulse. It was like $3.99. This is the Essence Blush Lighter. Oh, Blush Lighter. I thought it was Blush Lights. But it's Blush Lighter Gradient Powder Blush um, in Coral Sunset. So, Sassy Red. Oh, we're still freaking talking about my sunburn. Okay, okay. I can't believe that your burn hasn't tanned up at all. Is it? Okay, no. <laughs> Let me explain. Let me make a statement on behalf of my, my sunburn. It is a tan, but the rest of me is literally like a pasty porcelain shade. So the tan next to the white makes it look red, but it's not. If the rest of my body were equally burned, then I would look tan. However, that's not the case. <laughs> oh my God. I like, I am, I, I had no idea that I would have to have to defend tan lines like this. This is really something. Okay. <laughs> Joanna Yoss, on behalf of pale people everywhere, please stop commenting on our sunburns. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Here's the interesting thing, guys, even though I'm pale, I actually tan very well. Like, I mean, I just have to say, there was a time when I played Anita in West Side Story, and yes, you should be upset by that and defended, but you best believe I was the tannest version of myself I could ever be. Like, whoa. But I stopped all that. I stopped all that. Okay, this is what we're using for an eyeshadow. Because I just, because I just, I just don't, we can't, we can't get complicated here. Tonight, I've decided. So the, the thing about this, this that's really cool, we'll find out. The idea is cool, it's gradient. So I don't know if you can see, but this side is matte and then this side is a highlight, it's shimmery. I don't know how pigmented it's gonna be, but we'll see. Oh yeah, it's very subtle. You're, ba you're barely gonna be able to, it's okay. We're doing, we're doing a subtle, Oh, it's, yeah, it's very light. All right, let me just get, let me get a brush, let's get in there. Sarah, Sarah Kleinsmith, I'm Mexican-American and once had to, had to tan 
Oh, she's told me this before. Had to tan to play a Mexican-American woman in a play in college. Isn't that fucked up? Newsflash, Latinx come in all shades, y'all. That is, that's not right. That's not right. Wow. Just so many things, just, just looking back at all the not right things. I'm still looking for the masks. Okay, well, um, I think they're, they're, they should be the very first thing in the merch store. If you click on the merch store in the description box, it should be the first thing that pops up. But, but, but they're there, they're there. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna quicken this up because there's no need to belabor there's no need to belabor a very sort of not pigmented peach blush on the eye. There seems to be some dispute as to whether or not the mask is the first thing in the store. I mean, unless, unless the store sh pops up differently depending on who you are as a person, it should be the first, Randy's gonna link it. That's, that'll solve it, it'll solve it. It'll solve it, I hope. All right, well, we're done with that. I mean, this is, I'm not mad about this. This just isn't interesting. Okay, we're done with that. Next, just do, I'm just using, I think I forgot to link this. This is just, I mean, who cares? It's just a, it's just a, it's a liner. It's a brown liner. Oh, Randy linked the masks. Link the masks. Okay. Maggie, I can't wait to, to send you the fan art I made of you, Kate. Oh, that's so sweet. Also, Linda Live Your Life sent me fan art, and I've been meaning to post it on the gram. I'm going to do that. And now I feel like I'm using that un, not ironically. Unironically, um, I can't be that person who starts to say the gram in all seriousness. On Instagram, <laughs> it's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. It's very like pop art. It's so, so cool. So thank you to Linda Live Your Life. I will definitely post that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Michelle is taking me into the kitchen to make some dinner, chicken fried rice. Okay. I love that. Just like the idea of like someone just taking me into the kitchen and making rice. <laughs> It's, it's very, it's very absurd and I love it. So guys, tomorrow I'm putting out a video that's in collaboration with Better Off Red, because we haven't done one in a long time, and Mr. Kong's mom. And it's the eyeshadow palette tag, which Turned out to be one of the most fun videos to film. It was so great. I'm really enjoying watching other people's eyeshadow palette tags. It's very much the same vibe as like a what's in your bag because you just never know what someone's going to pull out. Like there's, there's like one of the questions is your oldest palette. It's like, these are relics guys. It's like you, it's, you, it's like pulling it out from the crypt. <laughs> it's going to be really good. So definitely. Well, I mean, if you hit that notification bell button, you won't have to look for it because you'll get notified. How about that? See what I did there? A little sort of guilting, guilting mother situation. Okay. 
Yes, Michelle Wong's video, the eyeshadow palette tag, was amazing. Okay. I'm also going to just do a little under eye lining here. So why not? Why not? Oh, Anastasia Harrison is saying, if you haven't thumbs this video up, you better get on it. Yes, yes. Okay. Next. We're moving on to something more interesting. Wait, is there some confusion? Confuge? Met, Met is here from Norway. How are we? We're great, Met. Thanks for asking. No one, the mask, okay, here's the thing, I think, um, and I don't expect anyone to understand this. I, I totally get it. Um, the mask, like Teespring doesn't sell, I mean, they might sell out of like colors or sizes, but like it can't sell out because when you order, so when you place an order, it is made just for you. Like that, that shit is being printed for you. So like the masks, unless, I mean, they sell out of the actual masks themselves, the fabric, which <sighs> Teespring, if that happens, I will come and I will find you and we will have words. Mm. Yes, I took my second Advil, Advil. <laughs> and yes, sometimes I take them with mine. Don't you judge me. Don't you judge me. Okay. We're going to do, I'm very excited about this. I don't usually get excited about brows. Um, but I am because not really because of this, but I, I have been looking for a dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow is cause mine is done for. I could just get another one, but I'm like, why not try something new? So this is from Milani. It's just medium Brown, the precision brow pencil going to see how she does. Helene still doesn't have the link. Guys, what's happening? I feel like Randy is just linking up a storm there in the kitchen. He's just linky McLinkersons, just linking all the links and people still can't find the link. How do we, how do we get you the link? Guys, it's an emergency. We need a link in here. Doctor, I need a link or nurse. I Nurse, I need a link, a link to face mask, the Teespring face mask, thank you. I can't open this. This is really just me not being able to open this. <laughs> well, this is Milani. I mean, what? <laughs> no, I'm fine. It's just like, the... oh my God, it's like stuck in here. Milani, did you, did, I think they made <laughs> the pencil too big for the, the plastic. <laughs> oh my God. I have a scissor. This is insane. I've never, I've never seen such a thing. I know. I know. I'm not learning any lessons. I'm just like, oh, I'll unbox it live. It'll be fine. And then like, I have the, I have like the worst, it, I look like I don't know how to unbox anything. <laughs> well, my fingers are very sore now. So you're welcome. Jenny's here. She was making dinner. Hi, Jenny. <sighs> well, now I'm sweating. Okay. We're going to see, we're going to see if this is dupe worthy here. Oh, is Teespring giving people, is Teespring trying people? Guys, am I going to have to do a course on how to access Teespring? I don't know that I'll actually be able to tell you anything helpful though. So <laughs> I 
Jenny, you're giving me Chiquita Banana vibes. Chiquita Banana Lady vibes, and I'm digging it. Thank you. I'm digging that as well. I didn't even think about that, but that's true. That's very true. Although I think the Chiquita Banana Lady didn't have tan lines, so. What are you gonna do? It's all, we're, it's all gonna come back to the tan lines. Everything we talk about now is gonna, we're gonna make, it's gonna be a full circle. Okay, so this isn't like as amazing. Like I feel like I kind of have to go in a little bit more with this, but I mean, listen. For what I paid, it looks good. Yeah, that does the job. And I like the shade. <laughs> oh, Mary Rodriguez, she ordered the face mask. Thanks, guys. Okay. Dina McAuliffe, please try the NYX micro brow pencil for a dupe for the Anastasia. We have the same coloring. Okay, well, noted, noted. Steph's Beauty Stash has to go. Bye, Steph. Enjoy your third drink. Where do you, Steph, where are you going? Just, just what, I mean, it's fine. I'm just saying, where, where, like, do you, I want to go. I want to have a place to go. <laughs> just kidding. I'm just kidding. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's good. I'm not mad about that. Okay, but the actual, I can't believe how hard it was to get that out of the packaging. That was bananas. Do you like Raquel Welsh? Do you, do you follow Kinky Sweat here on YouTube? She's also, new um, duh, we're like friends. So like, I don't even know what you're talking about. Like, I don't know how you didn't know that. <laughs> no, but really she's amazing. And yes, I, I, I love her. We did our um, like yearly roundup of beauty. That was a collab that we did together and it was great. I loved it. <laughs> and Viscardi, I want to have a place to get invited to so I can decline. Fair, fair. Okay. So I've always wanted to try this. I got soap brows. And this is from Makeup Revolution, also another brand I've never owned anything from until now. This is the Soap Styler for Laminate Fluffy Natural Soap Brows. You guys know I like a fluffy brow. You guys know I like a fluffy feathered brow. If this tries me, you're gonna think that I can't open anything, but I'm having some trouble. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Guys, this is not just me. Like, I, I swear, I swear. I did I did just trim my nails, but this is unacceptable. Oh, okay. Get the Sweeney Todd knife. <laughs> no, it's fine. Get the Sweeney Todd knife. No, it's fine. I got it. <sighs> okay. So, here's what this looks like. Allie Sun, need to work on your fine motor skills. Well, thanks for pointing it out, Allie. While I'm working on my tan lines, I'll also work on my motor skills. Jeez. Is this like where I come to feel terrible? <laughs> I don't even know how to do this, but I'm gonna do it. So you apparently take this, this little brush and then you scrape it against this soap and then you put it on your eyebrows. Oh, oh, that mirror. Oh, okay. Here we go. The mirror is actually legit. I just really feel like not enough soap is getting on here. Like, okay. People are saying add water or wet it or something. Oh, I have to wet it? 
to spray it. Really? Add water. Are you guys tr playing a trick on me? I, sw I swear to God, if I find out, if I find out that this is all just a sham <laughs> to make me look bad, oh, I need to spray it. Oh, oh. Okay, I should have read the box. Note to self. Oh, that's much better. Oh, that makes sense. Oh, that's nice. I like that. I'm into it. Jen Tolbert Tolbert, you can totally just use regular soap, but this looks fancier. Yeah, no, I realize that. I think and I think this is only like this is definitely less than ten dollars. Um I like it. Yeah. I mean, I kind of feel like, well, this might hold them better. I feel like I can kind of get in there more with like a, a boy brow. Well, maybe I'm speaking too soon. Hold please. Oh yeah. No, this is, this is like a shellac. This is, this, I'm into it. I'm into it. But this is also made for like a peanut. Like what's happening? I'm just like, let me... <laughs> Just struggling, just with giant hands. Just, okay. Mm hmm mm hmm Okay, no, I, I was wrong. I love this. I love this because this is like, wow. Yeah. You put soap on your brows and that shit's not going anywhere. Molly McKay, Barbie called, she wants her brush back. Exactly, exactly. I could have used a spoolie, but like, do I wanna put the spoolie that I love so much into the soap? Like, I don't think I do, you know? Okay, I, I think I brushed the left eyebrow up too much because that eyebrow is higher anyway. And I like to, okay. Okay, well, I, have I used the Ta Patrick Ta brow stuff? I thought about it and I looked at the reviews and it wasn't reviewed very highly or very well. It didn't get good reviews is what I'm trying to say. And I'm, you know, for what you pay for Patrick Ta, I'm like, well, I don't know about that. Okay, my brows look great. I'm into this, this is good. Okay, Makeup Revolution. I think this is actually new from what I can recall. I think they just put this out. I think. Oh my gosh, I'm exhausted. I'm exhausted. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now, now we're going to do mascara because you know that that makes everything better. Everything better. I'm using, my, oh. Oh, sorry. I got a notification, but it's like, um, okay. Bambi eye mascara. So this I'm really impressed with. And you know, as, as you know, it's a little touch and go with the drugstore mascara sometimes or the drugstore anything, but I do love this mascara. If you're looking for something inexpensive. Peggy Wallace, I gotta know if I'm going to get soap in my eyes and will it burn? Well, Peggy, I mean, you will if you put this directly into your cornea. If you go at your eyeball with this, you will get soap in it. Other than that, no. Oh, Linda Live Your Life said that's a shirt. Mascara makes everything better. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. It's going to get better. I mean, not that I, you know, I'm not hating on the look, but, you know, this always just really amps it up. Okay. 
Okay, well, I'm already getting mascara on my skin, so that's great. Guys, there are 323 people here and there's only 216 thumbs up. I'm being my own advocate, <laughs> which I don't know if that's actually the most attractive thing I can be right now, but listen, hey, listen. The better way to say that is, guys, I would love it if you could give this a thumbs up. It'd be so nice, oh my God. If you already thumbs up, I'm not thumbs up. I'm not talking to you. Okay. We don't we don't want to get into Tammy Faye territory, so we're gonna just gonna get all the nooks and crannies there. Okay. Now, the other eye. Isn't it amazing what mascara can do? How do you thumbs up when it's live? Okay, yeah, this kind of throws some people off. You have to just briefly just get out of the chat. You X that out of the chat, and then you just press this button, and then you get back in that chat. Did I tell you what this was? Sorry, I, this is L'Oreal. It's uh, it's a L'Oreal Bambi Eye Mascara. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yes, I have the Essence Lash Princess Mascara as well, Sarah Goldfarb, and I do like it. I do like it. I have that over here too. Have I tried, Ali Sun, have you tried the Bad Gal Bang Mascara? I haven't and people keep bringing it up. Do I need to try it? Is that what I need to do? I feel like I do because everyone keeps talking about it. Lindsay Taylor, how do I get the Kate emoji? Lindsay, you have to become a member of the Good Job Gang. <laughs> I'm sorry to tell you. Um... Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so we're done with the mascara. I will try the bad gal bang. Wow, I it's I everyone's talking about it. I'm getting it. I'm I'm in. I'm in. Mm. Okay, next we're getting to more interesting stuff. Jeez Louise. Um, I'm gonna do the Patrick Ta technique. I'm going to try to do it without his products. <laughs> so this I'm very excited about. Sarah Better Off Red. How many times can I say her damn name? My God. Loves this. This is the Flower Beauty Blush Balm Color Drops for Cheeks. A silky lightweight texture and a radiant finish. Um, I actually tried these when I was at her place. And I loved them. I really, really loved them. Now I'm like really insecure about opening things. So, <sighs> see what you did? Fine motor skills, working on them. 
Okay. So first things first. Oh, right. I opened this first, but I'm going to do the powder. This is not very pigmented. So we'll see how this goes. Um, we'll see. How, we'll see how it goes. Cause see how light it is. That's, that's pretty light. Okay. I mean, Get my mirror out. That's nice. I mean, if you, you eh. I mean, if you're a person who's like really freaked out by blush, first of all, stop it. But second of all, if you insist upon being that way, I guess get this because it's like whatever. We're gonna make it better when we put the cream blush on. No, it's shoot, it's just nothing. It's just nothing. No, it's not enough color for me. You're right, Lauren. <laughs> We're gonna make it better. It's gonna get better. You know what I think is gonna save the day? This, this Flower Beauty blush balm. So let's get in there. I also love the applicator. It's a good thing this is only $3.99. So that's what the shade looks like. It's basically the shade of my head wrap. And I'm just gonna put that on the back of my hand and then I'm gonna take my damp sponge. Do that. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yes, this is correct. Yes. So this is in the shade Melon. Melon. Oh, you knew I wasn't going to let that stand. You knew that was just going to... We're gonna have to figure something out there. Oh, this is gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, angry, <laughs> angry. <sighs> you know what's gonna happen? Flower, I don't always do this on live streams, but why not? Flower, flower, beauty, blush balm, and melon, good job. So good. I almost feel like maybe I should have put this on my eyes, but it's too late now. Okay, well that's that just literally made everything better. <laughs> so good. Guys, run do not walk. Run do not walk. Okay. So this is a no. This is a huge yes, huge. Do I feel like it's a dupe for the cloud paint? I do, I do feel like it is the closest thing I've come to, to a dupe for the cloud paint. Yes, that's correct. My lips feel parched. This does come in other shades, Sarah Goldfarb. You might check that out. This comes in other shades. They might have like a more muted shade. Yes, Dina. Dina said, I just wanted you to know I wear more blush now than ever because of you and I love it. Well, that's awesome. Yes. Okay. Guys, lips. I don't know about this lip combo now, but we're going to do it. No, I do know. I do know. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's just very, <laughs> I'm so like not into a nude lip. I just get start to get like oh, a nude lip. But, but the reason I wanted to talk about this was one, it's at Ulta. Two, this is my favorite Better Off Red. Oh my God. When is she going to stop saying Better Off Red? But she loves this and we love this together. This is the Amav Story. It's the Dose of Colors Liquid Velvet Lip, I believe it's called, in Amav Story. Hold on a second. Let me make sure this is blended. Um, 
the most comfortable liquid lip I have ever found in my entire life. And I don't like liquid matte lipsticks. I really, really don't. Um, Jenny is yelling at me. Are you getting boxy charm? Boxy charm. Boxy charm. <laughs> Losing your mind about boxy charm and go. No, I'm not. Okay. Uh so we're we're go <laughs> we're go Guys, when you put things in all caps lock, even if you have the best of intentions, you gotta back it up because you look you look like you lost your damn mind. Like it looks, it looks mildly abusive. Okay, so this is again this is a part of the Desi and, uh, Desi and Katie collection, um, and I'm obsessed. So we're just gonna do it. We're just gonna do it. It's a muted warm mauve. I wish you could feel how this glides on. It is literally like I'm putting coconut oil on my lips. It's, it's so beautiful. I believe this was the shade that, I just spat. I believe this was the shade that Katie chose. This is her like go-to shade, Luster Lux. Um, it doesn't even feel, it feels like I put a balm on my lips. It's just insane. So good. But if you think I'm not like putting a gloss over it, you've got another thing coming. Should I though? It's really pretty the way it is, but I'm going to put a gloss over it. Um, this is the ColourPop So Juicy and Let It Happen. This is sold out currently, um, but I, I put a dupe for this down in the description box. You can get it Ulta. Kathy Dixon is demanding more color. Well, Kathy, you know what? No, this is all you get. More color, please. <laughs> I wish people like, here's the thing. And I, we, we talk about this all the time by we, I mean like Michelle and Sarah and like, I wish people could see like how comments and ch like ch whether it's in a chat or, or in your comment, um, comment back box on YouTube, like how comments appear, like to you, it's just your comment that you posted. It's just like, do, 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 do just me. And for us, it's like, <gasps> Oh God, it's, it's all the comments. And then when someone's like, more color, <laughs> more color, please. It's like, it's like triple chins. It's just like, oh God, okay. It's so much blurting out in the comments. I'm telling you, when you're on the receiving end of like <laughs> a lot of comments, just it's just a tone thing that's all it's just a tone thing just tone just have some tone for god's sakes have some tone okay so we're going in with the so juicy in um let it happen which is like i mean it's pretty sheer honestly it's pretty sheer but it just i mean it's juicy it's it's it is what it says what more do you want from it Oh, I just pressed something. Wait, ah, ah, ah. All right. Okay, no, the gloss was correct. It was correct. You know, you guys know I can't avoid a gloss. I just can't do it. Okay, let me see why on earth. Okay, there we go. Okay, 
I was just making a general comment about comments. I wasn't talking about every single one of you. Everyone calm down. I probably wasn't talking about you, but if you think I was talking about you, well, I don't want to tell you. Um, no, the people who I was talking about aren't here and they're not listening. <laughs> I'm sure. Um, Okay, Annie Asuka, Annie Asuka Piatrovis, I know you were talking about me, lol. Well, Annie Asuka, Annie Asuka, Annie Asuka. Maybe just about the tan lines, just maybe. <laughs> no, I knew you meant it with love because you're here all the time. Okay, so now we're almost done. We're almost done. You know, we had to do a highlighter. I mean, clearly we're not gonna leave without a highlighter. So this is the, this is new as well. I've been wanting to try something from the I Love Sarahi and Dose of Colors collection. Um, Cause that palette was just freaking gorgeous. This is the highlighter. This is called Bathe. Um, it looks pretty dark. So we're gonna just, you know, see how this goes. I'm gonna use my handy dandy um, BK Beauty. This is my favorite highlighting tool. I love it. This is, I'm gonna swatch this for you just so you can kind of see. That's, that's the highlight. It's very bronzy. It's very like rose gold bronzy situation. I mean this, well, we're just gonna do it. We're just gonna do it. Oh, oh, oh my God. So good. Keep on forgetting to do a boop. Use it on my lids. Yeah, exactly. That's a good call. Ooh, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. Okay, well, that just made everything better. Oh my goodness gracious. This is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Honestly, I could just get by with wearing like bronzer and blush on my lids and then going over with my highlighter and that's like all I ever need in life. Boop. That is, okay. I was kind of nervous. I was nervous because it looks dark, right? But like that's, that's gorgeous, and it uh, it has like a very um. I almost, I almost feel like when I'm looking at it in the light. At least on my face, it almost has like sort of an opalescent reflect to it. Um. Yeah, it's a bronze gold. Yes, that's correct, Val. Sassy red. You sound like the test pattern sometimes when you do boob. <laughs> Okay, well, I love that. Okay, so, and then we're gonna finish it all off with Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Another, a lot of these things are better off red things. So that's why I've mentioned her so much because, well, one, she's amazing. And two, a lot of these were recommendations from her. This is like the finest mist you'll ever find, <laughs> honestly. So, so nice. Um, I love this. I love, okay, so these, this is, these are the stars of the show. Are you ready? Can you guess what they were? Star of the show, clearly I already talked about this. The, um, the flower, flower beauty blush bomb and this highlighter, this I love Sarahi and dose of colors highlighter is, I don't even know what to say. That is, that did not disappoint at all. Okay, and then the other things too, like the bronzer, the, that wasn't new, like the Physician's Formula Bronze. Oh, and this, how could I forget this? <laughs> really the star of the show is this foundation because it set the stage for everything else. Well, and, and, the, lip, and the lipstick, the lipstick too. Okay, so there are several things that we love. This, the Dose of Colors Velvet Lip, the Pretty Fresh Foundation, the I Love Sarahi, I just wanna say that name over and over again. And then, yeah, the blush bomb, so good. Anyway, guys, 
Wow. But we really had a night here, didn't we? We really had a night. Um, and I have to say, I'm not really a nude lip person, as you well know, but I'm, I just love this like warm mauve. I love it. Anyway, that wraps it up. That wraps up the whole look. Again, if you guys could please give this a thumbs up, subscribe, and also check out my merch, yo. Check out my merch. Listen, I'm going to tell you right now, you want this mask, and I don't care if I sound like a salesperson. Yeah, that's right, I am. I am a salesperson right now. <laughs> you want this damn mask because it looks bomb, it's relevant. It's saying something without you having to say anything. What more do you want? Okay, so check that out. That's in the description box. Thank you guys all so much for being here. This was really fun as always. I do these every Monday and Wednesday at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I'll see you next Monday. I'll see you next Monday. Okay? Sound good? Cheers till next time. Bye.